All right, guys, tonight we have the showdown. We are putting seven cars head to head in a challenge to see which car sounds the best. We are using a panel of judges to decide which car sounds the best. So we have Kevin here. Introduce yourself. I'm Kevin. Are you nervous? Camera shy? No. Well, how do you really feel? I, I don't know what to do here. <laughs> <laughs> we have my beautiful wife, Michaelin, and we have Jackson Bowie. I wash cars. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost like my name's Jeff. My name is Jeff. <laughs> All right, so we are going to be running with these seven cars over here. No reason to wait around. Let's just jump right into it with car number one. And it's a secret because the judges are going to have a competition to see who can guess the car the best. So they will not be able to see the car that is going and they will make a guess as to which car it was and whichever judge gets it right the most. I don't know what they'll win, maybe like 20 bucks or something. Who knows, but let's get this started. All right, guys, first up, I gotta say this really quiet because they're just right over there, is the 4.5 liter naturally aspirated V8 from Ferrari. Yes, that's right, the Ferrari 458. And we are getting ready to start blasting some eardrums. <laughs> judges do we have a verdict okay does everybody made their decisions yeah. do you have your guess of the car written down are y'all ready you want our score yeah. first or score first okay, okay. Score all, right. all right kevin kick us off we got a seven okay we got a seven we got a seven <laughs> are we in vegas triple seven everybody needs to relax we're all going to vegas right after we're done filming this Let's video go. all right kevin what was your guess for the first car I'm gonna go with the 458. The 458, okay, okay. It was a 458. Mick, Ferrari 458. <laughs> you know, that's pretty crazy because I could have sworn I saw you write AV a minute ago. Well, we were debating. We, we were, yeah, we were debating. debating. Are y'all yeah, like mingling? No, we're not debating. Don't, don't, know that. don't let me catch y'all mingling. No, I don't know. I don't know that. Okay, genuine. Jackson, Italian. 458. Look at that, guys. Trips they got it all right. For the first score for the Ferrari 458, we have 21 points. 21 points, that is the number to beat right now. He was first up, he set the bar. Let's see what happens next. thing sounds really, really good. I actually felt an actual heat wave from that. Wasn't stupid. that crazy? That's stupid crap. <laughs> Ridiculous. All right, judges. We're back for round two. Okay, does everybody have their guesses ready? Everybody's ready. Should, should we give Should we give the number, the, the rating, and then flip the card if you have the guess? No, we'll do one at a time. One at okay, time. one at a time. Let's start out, guys. Kevin, what was your number? He gave it a five. That's a rough start. That's a rough start. Mick, what you got? Eight. An eight? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold the, what, what? Oh my whoa, gosh, whoa, whoa, wow, generous. that is a, that is a crazy score to give when one of the most iconic cars went first when it comes to sound. Yeah. Okay. Really? Yeah, Which car was that? The, the one you already guessed, the Ferrari 458. <laughs> now Jackson, finish us off. We have a six. What do you think the car was, Kevin? The E63S. This guy right here, he's got it figured out. Look at this guy. E63S. All right, honey. She got it right too, Jackson. Wild guess. I don't know. Should we should we not count it because there's no S? Ah, get it out of here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just playing. Get it out I'm of here. I'm just playing. The Mercedes. Oh, who wrote it down? Mark. Mark, don't write it down. <laughs> <laughs> this guy, man. <laughs> he thinks he's got control he around to here. Help. Let's bold that a little bit. Okay. Where are you going? 19. The Mercedes is now trailing the 458 by just a few points. And uh, we're on to the next one. Yeah. 
Judges, I hope you have your answers. Is everybody ready? Ready. Y'all ready? Yeah. Kick it off with us, Jackson. 18? <laughs> I'll give it an eight. It's an eight? It's an, it's an, eight. an eight. Okay. Yeah. What you got? Whoa! We got a 10. The first 10 of the night. Yeah. That is a big number. Kevin, let's be realistic here, sir. <laughs> it gets a seven? A seven. Okay. Okay. Seven. All right. All right. All right. All right, guys, we got 25 for the Huracan, and that puts the Huracan in the lead. We are gonna find out if the judges are gonna break their streak of getting every single one right so far, and we're gonna start with Kevin. Kevin, what car do you think it was? The Lamborghini? Huracan. The Huracan, wow. <laughs> you know, I don't know whether to be offended or laugh because he is one of my best friends, so like, how could you really be mad at him? Wifey, what you got? Dang, I like the way you did that. Okay, okay, okay. That's me, in case y'all are wondering. I'm her baby, okay? And Jackson. Okay. They continue the streak. They are 100% getting everything right so far, and we need to get the Sharpie and add the number 25. All the supercars, and we've got a freaking Camaro with a parachute on it. How ridiculous is this? Now, I think it's gonna be pretty easy for the judges to guess which car that is, and that car is gonna take just a couple minutes to warm up because that thing is pushing 1,300 wheel horsepower. So we're gonna give him a few minutes. The monster is pulling up to the line. Ridiculous. We just got through the loudest car by a long shot. So judges, are y'all ready? Kevin's just gonna jump right in. Okay, I guess we're that gonna start. Sweet. I guess we're gonna start with you. So that that's a 10? Look at this guy. All right, all that right. That was a screamer. Look what you got, honey. We got yeah. another 10? Oh my gosh, Jackson. A nine. Yeah, right now, right. now, that still takes the lead with 29 points. But before we go write the score on the board, let's ask the judges what car they thought it was, as if it's any kind of surprise. Jet powered Everybody all at once. One, two, three. <laughs> what is your say? Jackson wow, wins. Like <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. And now guys, in first place, we have, of course, a 1300 wheel horsepower Camaro ZL1. Where are we at? You know what's crazy is the ZL1 wasn't even actually supposed to be in this competition. The Dodge Demon was, but he had a last minute thing. He could not make it here. 29. And uh, 29. 29, that's what that's I said. 29. That's Why are they interrupting me? You know, the judges, they need to learn their place in this world, okay? 29 points for the ZL1. First place as of right now. All right, guys, now this car is a surprise and they, it's not even on the board. They have no idea that this car is even brought out here. But of course we have the electric Rivian about to do a launch and it's gonna be crazy. Room, room, bop, bop, bop. <laughs> oh my gosh. That one definitely launches the hardest. That one definitely launches the hardest. <laughs> So confused in there guys they have no idea what's going on all right judges there's no time to waste what are we rating that one guys i mean i can't hear anything a two i don't know what it is i, I can't hear anything <laughs> all right honey let's see what your number is number one jackson number one that's not very surprising not very surprising at all guys now what do y'all think the car was i think it was a tesla a tesla yeah a tesla no idea no idea. Yeah. It, it kind of sounded like You know what? No Minus one point for Jackson because he's being Zero. lame. <laughs> Zero. Oh. But guys, that was a trick car. It's not even on the list. 
That was the new Rivian truck. Oh. And uh, all you got was tire noise. Yeah. A little chirp there at the beginning. So, yeah. on to the real next car. Judges, all right. We are more than halfway there. Okay, you have your scores, you have your guesses. All right, scores first. Let's go. Starting with wifey. A 10 out of 10. Watch out, Jackson. We've got an eight. And Kevin, we are about to find out if you're the ultimate kiss ass or not. A nine, okay. Well, did you only do that because I said kiss ass? No, I knew what it was. Okay, okay, okay. All right, and before we write the score on the board, we know the Aventador got 27 points and is now in second place. All right, Kevin, what do you think the car was? Start us off. Aventador. The Aventador, okay. The Lambo Aventador. A vent and a door. <laughs> a vent and a door. You know, legend has it, that is exactly how Lamborghini came up with the name of the car. You know, they were just pondering and thinking and they saw a vent, they saw a door, they're like, a Aventador. The Aventador is now in second place with 27 points. Now I'm getting sad. My car just keeps going further and further down on the list. I should have put mine for last. <laughs> yes, unfortunately, my boy over there with the Mercedes is sitting down here with his measly 19 points. At this point, there could be a trade in coming. We're not really sure. He might be going through some emotional anxiety. Just keep him in your prayers, guys. is ridiculous. That car has a full Dundon straight pipe race exhaust that is so freaking nuts. I'm gonna let y'all choose who goes first this time. Who wants to go first? Jackson's going first, and we have the 10 out of 10. Jackson Bowie, everybody. Wifey gives it a 10. We've got quite the contender here. We have quite the contender here. Kevin, finish this off. I like what I hear. Oh my gosh, we have a perfect score. What? An even 30 points. I win again. Oh my gosh. So Mark here also has a GT3 RS. So he's winning in spirit. Everybody already knew what it was. All right, judges, what are your guesses? Kevin, start us off. GT3 RS. Wifey, whoa! We have our first incorrect answer? Oh my what? gosh, how do you feel about that? I tell you what, the viewers are probably amazed that you got this far with a 100% rating. Oh. But you got one wrong, I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. I don't know what to say. We got this showdown between Kevin and Jackson, but ja he got it right. The GT3 RS. Sorry, wifey. It's hey, I guess that though, and then I changed my mind. What? You changed your mind? Yes. No! I changed my no. mind. No! Too bad for her. We have our first perfect score. Congratulations to the Porsche. GT3 RS with a perfect score of 30 points. Alright Dylan, you're good. So obviously, they know what car it is, okay? The last one left, guys. The last one left. But we don't know what their scores are. Kev, start us off. We have a six to good. kick it off. Wifey? Seven. So we know this car will not be the winner. Not even close, obviously. We got an eight. Now, just because, guys, tell me what y'all thought it was. Oh. Oh, Kev. I had golf cart. The golf cart? Yeah. Yeah? You ever driven a golf cart that sounded like that? Ridiculous, yeah, right? Insane. The most fun thing in the world? Insane. No. But 
it was fun. I, yeah? I had a good time. All right, all right, wife, what do you Obviously, think it was? since I got the last one wrong. Oh, and Jackson. Prototype. <laughs> the 2025. Dixon Ticonderoga. <laughs> and to close it out, guys, the Nissan GTR with 21 points. Somehow, that got the same score as a Ferrari 458. I'm not sure how. It doesn't make any sense at all. These judges are clearly uneducated. <laughs> and in first place, we have the Porsche GT3 RS. Kind of cheating. It's got a full Dundon race exhaust. Not a fair competition whatsoever. But, he came, he showed up. We appreciate him for being here. And he is the winner with 30 points. In second place, we have the Camaro ZL1 with 1300 wheel horsepower. Not sure how he didn't win. It is what it is, the judges made their decisions. In third place, we have the Lamborghini Aventador with 27 points. In fourth place, we have the Huracan with 25 points. And then in fifth, or was it fifth or sixth? I'll lose track of these things, guys. But the Ferrari 458 and the Nissan GTR tied by some crazy stretch. I don't know how that's possible. The Ferrari 458 is one of the best sounding cars ever, but it tied to the Nissan GTR and then the wagon. Should we, should we, even, should we even discuss the wagon? Everybody, like I said, keep dealing in your prayers, okay? He's going through a lot of emotional anxiety you know, at this point, I'm surprised the car isn't already sold, but the good news is he has a he has a 458 at home, so that makes up for it a little bit. All right, guys, thank y'all so much for watching another video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. We had such a sweet lineup of cars, and it was not easy to get all these people together. The judges made their decision, but leave a comment down below. Let me know which car you think sounded the best, and, uh, you know, maybe this one, guys, right here, maybe. Like I said, guys, thank y'all so much for watching. Make sure you smash that subscribe button, and we'll see you next video. Peace.